Hey everyone, welcome to today's Day Trading Recap, Wednesday, March 24th. A uh, decent green day today, 1,192.75. So let's go through these. I'll show you what happened. Starting with the Mighty 90s, we had two Mighty 90s, uh, both winners. MU Nice winner, 494. Roku, plus 70. Did a pairs trade in the Russell versus ES, booked 139.50. And then on the Runners... Uh, actually, we had two for two here. Uh, Beyond plus 212, Tesla minus 145, Twitter plus 561, and then the ES one I just closed out ended up booking a loss of 138.75. So let's check these out, show you what happened. Uh, starting with the mighty 90s in MU. So in MU, had this initial weakness. Uh, coming down, had a nice volume spike here, got long, uh, rode this thing, got out of uh, the majority of my contracts right here at the unchanged mark and this pivot because uh, I thought we'd see some resistance there. I held a couple contracts just in case we got a bigger push when this thing started kind of breaking down. I ended up closing out the last piece and uh, and just taking a loss on, or excuse me, uh, booking, booking my profits there, plus 494. Roku was a small winner. So in Roku, whoop, had this uh, initial weakness here, got long right here, and uh, got out of most of it right here. I was trying to get out of the rest. I, I closed half, and then as we approached this bar, I was trying to get out of the rest. It kind of dropped on me, so I ended up getting out of the last piece right here. So only booked 70 bucks on the trade. Could have gotten a better fill had I tried to exit just a little bit earlier, but uh, still slightly green on the Roku trade. On to the runners, Beyond Meat, plus 212. So in Beyond, had this uh, initial flush here. And then when it, uh, the market was, was pretty weak. And so on this bounce, I was looking for something to get short. Uh, Beyond was pretty weak on the day. So as it bounced up to the uh, yesterday's low, got short right here. Got out of most of it. Was still just holding on to one contract, seeing if we get some more flush. When it started pushing, 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 and pushed up, I ended up closing out the, the last one right here. Obviously, in hindsight, it kind of tailed off right after that, but still booked a decent little profit there. Tesla, Tesla was a little bit frustrating because I had a really nice profit and ended up giving it all back. Uh, but I had this big volume uh, push here, so I got short on this bounce and took a little bit of heat, and then it flushed down. Uh, I ended up getting out of all of it at this point, so it was a nice exit. I was waiting for a bounce to get short again, so I got short right here. Almost rolled over. I was, I was really close to getting out of half right here, but didn't quite get down, and then it just pushed, 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 and ended up closing it out uh, right there. So I ended up taking a $145 loss on Tesla when I was up quite a bit more. Uh, Twitter was my biggest winner. Had a nice winner in Twitter on Monday as well on a downside runner. Uh, so Twitter showing some weakness, but this second volume bar just massive compared to the first. So I was waiting for a bounce, got short right here, and caught a big piece right there. When it bounced back up, I added back in right there, caught a nice another piece right there, and then I held the last piece and it kind of chopped around, held below yesterday's low, so I held my last piece and then it just fell apart, and so finally got out of my last piece right down here. So nice trade in Twitter for 561. And then my last trade of the day, this was something I entered after the live stream was over, but the market just started ripping, right? And uh, so then it pulled back, or maybe I got in this right before we got off. I think, I, yeah, I got, I got in this right before we got off the live stream. So I entered long here, and it pushed down a little bit more, so I, I added to it right here at this level, so right in this area. Got a nice bounce, closed half at this pivot, was looking for more, and then the market just kind of fell apart. I was done trading for the day, so I closed out my last piece. Ended up taking a small loss there, but still uh, over a thousand dollars today, eleven ninety two seventy five. So can't complain. Uh, we'll be streaming tomorrow and Friday. Look forward to seeing you in the room.